Welcome everybody and greetings. Thank you for allowing me a few minutes of your time after Mass today. I'm sorry I can't be with you in person, but I am pleased at least to be able to speak with you directly. As we begin, I want to express my gratitude to your parish priest and appeal representatives. Without their support and assistance, my appeal simply would not happen, so thank you. Next weekend will be the official launch of my annual Christmas appeal for Lifelink. However, today, as you leave the church, my appeal letters will be distributed in advance. I believe this Christmas appeal to be particularly important, as it is the main way in which we, as an archdiocese, are able to support so many people in very real need within the community. Pope Francis has called on the church and Catholics around the world to build and embrace a culture of engagement with the poor. He said in a recent visit to the marginalised that to love God and neighbour is not something abstract but profoundly concrete. It means seeing in every person the face of the Lord to be served, to serve him concretely. And you are, dear brothers and sisters, the face of Jesus. If we, each doing our own part, do good to others, if we meet there doing good, then slowly, gently, little by little, we will build that culture of encounter. We need that so much. We must meet one another doing good. Here Pope Francis is reminding us that it is not only in what we believe and what we say, but in what we do that we come to fully know and understand the message of love which Jesus brought to the world. Just as Jesus walked with and reached out to the poor, the lonely, the isolated and the abused, we too are called upon to live our faith through our active service to others. Pope Francis again spoke strongly about the need for us to engage with those who reach out for help when he said, to live charitably means not looking out for our own interests, but carrying the burdens of the weakest and poorest among us. If one gives to the poor without reaching out to them or asking them their name, then you have not encountered them. All you've done is tossed them some charity. Jesus' words are pretty clear. How you treat the least of these is how you treat me. Reaching out to the poor and the lonely, therefore, takes attention. Through the wonderful work of our LifeLink agencies, we bear witness to and are a vital part of engaging with people who reach out to us for help. Our LifeLink agencies reach out to, engage, walk with and help more than 31,000 Western Australians in need each year. In a few moments, you'll be handed this envelope. It contains my Christmas appeal message. I encourage each and every one of you to please read the information I have provided and to give generously to my appeal. Today, I would like to issue a challenge to each and every one in the community to help raise a minimum of $650,000 for people in need this Christmas. Donate a dollar, five dollars, fifty dollars, or whatever you can. It's up to all of us, and not just a generous few, to help make a difference. I wish you every success conducting the appeal in your parish, and I thank you once again for allowing me to spend this time with you.